Chris here with Imagine If Magic, and I've got a great trick. I know you're going to like it. Let's take a look. I give you the skeleton and the haunted house. Now, the skeleton likes to play jokes on people who come and visit his house, all right? He's not a scary skeleton. He's just a little bit of a jokester. So sometimes when people are over at his house, he likes to completely discombobulate himself, just like that. Pieces everywhere. So it's up to the people visiting the house to put him back together. So they go in first by his feet, followed by his body, followed by his head. And with the wave and the snap of a finger, not only does the skeleton play the joke on the people, but he comes out messed up. So, they have to do it again. They knock him over again just like that. And they have to start all over. First by his feet, followed by the body, followed by the head. Now this time they think they got him, but with the wave and the snap of the finger, the skeleton comes out all messed up again. So, there's a couple of ways you can fix this, but the easiest way is to get rid of the head. You have to get rid of the head. So, I'm going to take the head. I'm going to put it right here in my pocket. All right? Putting him away just like that. Now he's gone. But, as soon as the people staying in the house think that it's all over and that they finally got the skeleton to behave, with the wave and the snap of a finger, not only does he come back, but he comes back to joke around another day. And that is the skeleton in the haunted house.